Hello people, how are you all doing? Guess everyone is so good. Today in the kitchen, I'm preparing this concussion rice. But there's a twist to this my concussion rice. If you can see on my table here, there's no tomatoes. I'm going to be using this carrot, potache, shombo, onions and pepper. If you are in Nigeria and in the west or in the south, you know that the price of tomatoes has skyrocketed. Little tomatoes, the price for 1,000, 2,000. So today I'm preparing this rice. I'll be using carrot as my tomatoes. So on the table, you can see everything I'll be using for this my um, rice. So guys, first of all, I will boil this uh, tatashe and carrots. Normally, I like boiling my tomatoes when I want to cook my stew. So I'll just chop the carrot into bits, then put in a pot to cook for some time so it will be a bit uh, tender. So guys, let's do this together. So guys, I'm cutting the carrot to be like this. Put them in the pot. Then I'll boil with its own water. I'm not going to be adding any water into that pot. As it the tache boils, it brings out its own water. So this is what I'm going to do. After boiling, you allow it to cool before you blend. The, the onions, everything is going in. I'm using this much pepper because I like my food to be a bit hot. I know carrot at times, or carrot is sweet. So I don't want that um, sugary sweetness. So I'm going to be adding this uh, amount of pepper to cut down the sweetness. If you are in Nigeria here, please tell me the price of tomatoes wherever you are watching from. Let me compare the price here in Port Harcourt where I live. So guys, I'll take it now to the gas cooker, let it start boiling. Why the tomatoes is on the fire? Sorry, the carrot and the tatashe is on the fire <laughs> boiling. Let me cut the scent leaf I'll be using. Scent leaf in Chongu, but you can use any leaf of your choice. This is what we have after boiling the carrot and the tache. It's um, cool now, so I'll put in the blender, then blend, then we can start cooking. <coughs> I'll just take it easy so it can blend very well. You can decide to add water or depends on how your blender works. I'll just add a little water in this because this, this blender is not too strong. So I'll just add a little water in here. So my people, see what we have here? This is the first batch that I blended. Any difference? Eh? If there's any difference, let me know in the comment section. <laughs> My people, hmm. if you are following me to this moment, please hit the subscribe button, like this video, 
give the video a thumbs up turn on your bell and keep liking please this ministry has to move the permanent site hmm? help your girl Benny so now the pot is on the fire so just add some palm oil remember is native concussion rice that we are cooking I'll allow the oil to be hot before I pour in the other ingredients. So the oil is hot now and I'll add in the chopped onions. I'm adding the local beans so they can fry together. So I'm adding in the um, paste now, carrot and tatashe. I like it to cook very well. You know, when you boil or roast your uh, pepper and tomatoes, you don't, uh, it doesn't take time to cook much again. That's why I like boiling my tomatoes or roasting before I cook. So when I'm making my stew, it doesn't stay long frying. So I just allow this to cook for like five to eight minutes. Let it um, stay now, and then I'll come back. This is what we have here. So I'll add in my seasoning. I'm adding bouillon cube all-purpose seasoning then I'll be adding crayfish these are the only seasonings I'll be using then I'll add some salt I can wait adjust the salt so I'm adding the rice now i parboil the rice because i just want it to cook sharp sharp It looks like real tomatoes, no much uh, difference. Guys, what do you think? So at this point now, I'll add the water that will be enough to boil this rice very well. Let me taste for salt and if I'll add some more. I think I'll add some more salt. The pepper in it is okay. So I'll cover the pot and let it uh, cook. My people, see what we have here. If I tell you eh, the aroma in my kitchen, I've never experienced anything like this before. The aroma is so, so sweet. Let me use the word sweet. So this is what we have here now. The water is almost dry. The, the, the rice is a bit hard. So what I'll do now is to cover it and then lower the heat, let it use the steam 
to cook very very well so just cover like this and trap in all the steam then i'll come back so 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 i'm back this is what i have here the rice is dry so i'll just add the scent leaf stir and cover for a minute to cook then i'm adding some more crayfish so i'll just combine everything together wow look at what we have here carrots on caution rice that is the name i'm giving to this hmm? if you like what you are seeing tell me something in the comment section just keep liking this video give the video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't done that please share to your friends family your neighbor any person around you just share so guys this is our cook, uh, our carrot concussion jollof rice i tell you the aroma here is so awesome you can take this with any person of your choice but i'm taking mine with fried fish so guys i'm done i don't want the um, scent leaf to be overcooked so i just turn off the heat now i'll see you in my next video thanks for watching and bye bye